this is Hypixel Skyblock and I'm about to spend the next 100 hours of my life farming in it. I started off trying to get melon armor because I thought it was good for the game overall. I also had a co-op whose name was Peeprex. We farmed up like a million corns which I put on my rookie hoe. Also if the progression here is uh, slow that's because me and my friend barely knew anything about this game as you can see here we built multiple farms in one plot. But uh, we did end up featuring out the how to use the preset. But before I got my melon armor I decided to upgrade my armor to pharma armor which gave me an additional 20 farming fortune. Ok so I just uh, built a sugarcane farm and I got 2.7k mined so yeah. And I just mined 88,000 in 20 minutes which gave me a bronze medal so let's go. I bought it. That, that costed me so much time for But now I can mine melons even more efficient. But I might have forgotten to record that. And if you're for some reason not a Skyblock player, the one all the way to the left is uh, a melon armor, which is the one I'm going for. Anyway, back to the grind. Also, I decided to make my sugarcane plot twice as long. Apparently this um, lantern helmet gives me way more farming fortune than my farm armor helmet gives, so yeah. Also this is my next goal I guess. This is the higher time I have been using the sweet axe, which is like the first axe you get and that's why I'm buying the advanced gardening axe. Also I put the Sunder 2 on it and then I quickly got the under K on the pumpkin collection. After this last one then I have 8 bronze medals which means that I am able to buy the melon dicer. One, two, three, four silver medals and finally one gold medal, let's go. And finally, I have the melon dicer pog. Dude, this thing is so cool when it comes up like uncommon shops and stuff. Garden level up to level 10, let's go bug. I can finally use mushrooms. Then I decided to sell my 4000 compactor and buy a 5000 compactor. I also decided to buy mathematical hoe blueprint and make it into a potato hoe. And after the, all that, I can finally craft my first piece of melon armor. And with my new leggings, I finally got my first silver. Potato T2? Ok, so I just logged on and my co told me that we had gotten a green bandana. Which uh, then I sold on the auction house for 30 million coins, which at the time was the lowest win, I know it's kinda crazy. Also I bought my first Lotus equipment. Also I bought cultivating and put it on my axe. Then I spent all of my life savings to buy one booster cookie. And with that I got farming 28. And cultivating 7. Then I bought a builder's ruler in order to build custom farms. Ok so I just built uh, this uh, melon farm. Um, it, yeah it took a while and you farm it like this. Then I crafted my final piece of melon armor. I don't need the boots because I'm going to use Hensher's boots instead. Farming 32. 
Uh, so the past I update just did help and um, I guess that's kinda cool. Uh, let me see if I can find a pest here. Um, there we go. My first pest that I killed, I think. Um, I didn't drop anything, but that's fine. Cool new update, I guess, and many new ways to get farming fortune. That's cool. Also, I might have upgraded my armor to Croppy, and I genuinely just do not know where that clip went. Then I got uh, one more bronze medal in order to buy the personal best perk from uh, Anita. Okay, so I just uh, got a new visitor and it's time for garden level up to 11, let's go. Farming 34, let's go. Okay, so currently these are my stats, and I don't even have a Kim even halfway to Fermento, so like, I still got a long way to go, you know. I just uh, got to uh, cultivating 9 and I missed it on camera because I'm smart. Um, but anyway, okay, so I just uh, hit the uh, farming 35 and also I got all of the materials to craft squash armor, so let's do that. This is not gonna lie, the weirdest farming armor set of them all. But now when I can drop a fermenter, it's time to put away my dicer and take out my sugarcane now. And it's time to no life sugarcane farming, let's go. But before that, I just wanna mention that uh, this is both the most saddest and um, the most important thing of uh, this uh, series. So basically, my uh, friend quit Starbuck and then he decided to give me like 100 or 150 million coins in contraband because he weren't able to play, you know, like he didn't want to play. To just look at this potato, that's stacked bro. With a potato hole like that, I built a huge potato farm. Again, dude, I got one like literally just 150 visitors ago. I'm kind of RNG carried right now. Yeah, that RNG carry they kept happening because I got the first one RNG system and then one crazy there. Which gave me my first gold medal in pumpkin. Let's go. Dude, I can't believe that was how I leveled up my melon collection to level 26. Again? What? And I'm at 306. That's crazy. And with all the money I made it from green bandanas and the contraband. I finally went and bought a level 95 legendary elephant pet. That's my first time surpassing 1 million items collected in the melon contest, which is kinda cool. And with one final visitor, I finally hit farming 40, which means that I am able to use fermento. Luckily, I was able to farm up all of the sugarcane and all of the uh, fermento in order to craft the armor, so I won't have to buy that. And that's it, I got fermento. Now what? Sub for 200 hours. <laughs>